Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So, um, today I got you guys up on my tripod here, and I got you guys zoomed in to, um, my canvas, I should say. Um, and right now I'm working on some of these drills. Uh, and I don't think my camera likes to zoom or autofocus. Um, that I haven't, I still haven't fi uh, figured out. But these drills, um, they used to be oily and now they're not. I put them in this little, um, toilet paper thing and now they're all nice. So, but how is everybody doing today? Are you guys doing okay? Are you guys having a good day? Um, I'm currently am coming down sick, so I haven't really diamond painted a lot. Uh, so, you guys might hear me cough and all that stuff, but I, I, right now, um, I'm doing good. Okay, so that's all I needed with that. But yeah, they're not as early, early anymore. So, I think I found a way to take care of the oiliness versus having to wash them beforehand. Let's put them in some toilet paper and voila. Okay, so. <coughs> uh, 6.48. Q. Do I have Q? Yes, I do. Okay. Um, I don't know what I was going to say. Oh. If you hear me coughing, I do apologize. I not I try not to cough a lot whenever I'm recording. If that makes sense. Um, I I think it doesn't. But um, yeah. This I'm just you know I'm coming down sick. My entire family is actually coming down sick. Uh, this is just like allergy season here in Oklahoma. So. Everybody who has allergies comes down sick around this time. And it's just, for me, it's a lot of draining and a, a lot of coughing. So, <coughs> I feel like I have a frog in my throat all the time. And my throat is kind of sore from all the drainage. And all I want to do right now is lay down in bed. I don't want to do anything else but lay in bed. And I've been doing that for the past couple of days. It's just laying in bed, falling asleep. But I also have to work, so doing that as well. But, eh. I'll get over it pretty soon. It doesn't take very long. It's just, like I said, it's just allergies, so it just takes a little bit to get over. <coughs> <coughs> and I mean, I haven't really gotten to the point. Sorry, I'm getting a cough drop. I haven't gotten to the point where I'm coughing a lot. So, there's some times where I just, I cough and cough and cough, and then I get sick, like, I, um, there was one day, I was coughing a lot, and I was actually coughing the entire day, like, I did not stop coughing, there was not a moment of rest between coughing, um, and it got me, it made me sick. So. I 
I, I don't like to, you know, get sick and all that stuff. But who does? There's a lot of people who don't like to be sick. So today is May 31st. As you guys can tell, I haven't got my other canvas in yet. Um, I just checked the I just checked the tracking number and it says it's out for delivery today. Which on the tw um it said that expected delivery was going to be on the 25th of May. And here it is the 31st and it's now out for delivery. So I don't know what's going on with um, the United States Postal Services but something is going on with them because for 10 days it was just sitting in Chicago. And I know Chicago is a big hub for packages coming into the United States. But just sitting there is just and not moving until oh on not being scanned as much. I don't know. There's some stuff going on and I don't know what's going on. Um but I'm not gonna fault it on the company because it's the United States Postal Service and not them. So, because it, it's been in Chicago since May 21st. Ten days later, and now it's out for delivery. So, we, we will see when I get it. Um, and I probably won't post a video of it up until I, the unboxing is done. Because I was thinking about that when I saw it coming in today. It's like, I already have an unboxing on Tuesday. It has to be next week. Or the week after. So, that... It looks like after um, the next following Tuesday is when I'm going to have that unboxing video out. So. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. Kind of wish this would auto focus but then again you know it is what it is so oh. I will be right back as soon as I figure out how to pause Okay, uh, sorry about that. Um, one of my brother's uh, feeding pumps went off, so I had to go take care of that. So, and then I had to get him up in his chair. But yeah, that's all I did. From time to time, you might hear a kid scream in the background. Uh, that would be my five-year-old little brother. You might hear a machine going beep, 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 beep. Not like that, but um, you'll hear some beeps. And it's one of two things. And it's either one of my brothers is desatting, which they're going under 89% oxygen intake or uh, something like that, I think. I don't know. I know it's it, they go under... 89% it goes it starts alarming but um, 
and then sometimes you'll hear maybe you'll hear a feeding pump go off uh, I try to record whenever um, there's somebody here taking care of them so that way I'm not um, having so much background noise I, or I try to record at night but since I've been coming down sick I have been going to bed earlier and earlier um, I can't there's like no way that I'm able just to sit up for 30 minutes or more on going through a diamond painting right now when I'm sick so I try to do it whenever I can um, so that of course even though um, I can do it at night when they're all asleep I still have to get up around 7 8 o'clock in the morning and then do it all of it again oh brother stop sorry um when he gets too excited that's my five-year-old by the way uh, whenever he gets too excited he starts screaming on top of his lungs and it sounds like something is wrong with him great oh shit what the fuck holy moly that came out of nowhere sorry we have earwigs uh, an earwig infestation again and a freaking earwig popped out of nowhere I see where it's at. Oh, blah. but um, we have an earwig infestation. We're like on a pocket of water or something, and these earwigs they will pop out of nowhere and scare the shit out of me. And I don't like touching them. I don't like them. Period. Ay, and I can't go get my bug spray. I want to smell that. Maybe I can scare it off. Oh my god. Okay. Um. Oh jeez. I put it on Team Yumi Zumi. He doesn't scream with Team Yumi Zumi. Damn it. Uh, sorry, there. <laughs> wow, there's an airwig. I'm kind of scared to come closer because they have pinchers. They're like little pinchers on the back, and so they can pinch you. Uh, and they fly, apparently. But yeah, we're on a pocket of water, so apparently we're going to have air rig infestation no matter what. And it all happened last year. We've been in this house for like three or four years now. And last year we had an infestation like crazy. And I think we stopped seeing them, I don't know when. I can't remember when we stopped seeing them, but we stopped seeing them after a while, and um, since then we haven't had a, an issue. During winter time, there was no issues whatsoever. Now it's spring, going on to summer, and it was moved by the way, so I'm moving around. Um, it's spring, going on to summer, and now we have earwigs popping out of everywhere and they scare the crap out of me so 
That is just awesome sauce. Mm -hmm. I think I'm done with this color. Nope. There's one right there. And another one. And we can't really, um, we had a, a, a guy come through to prep the house for earwigs. And he's like, well, there's a lot of points of entries. So there's not much that we can do. We can d go ahead and do it. And they prepped the house. But we have earwigs still. So... Great going. How much prep that helped. <coughs> I'm I'm ready to be done with earwigs. They're so creepy looking. They are really, really creepy looking to look at. <clears throat> but, um, yeah. Ill wigs, they have pinchers on the back. They have the two little pinchers on the back. Um, from what I've found online, they don't bite. They pinch you, and that's it. So, definitely be on the lookout for those I don't they're usually attracted to a lot of water and like I said apparently we have a pocket underneath us so they're attracted to here because of that pocket underneath um, but I mean that's what they said, you know, for the airways to be coming out in numbers like they are, it has to do with the fact that we are on a pocket of water, underground water or something. Um, that's the only reason why they would come out. And they're looking for, like, a place to, I don't know. We're looking for a place to be at, basically. Last year, I killed like over a hundred of them. Some, uh, sometimes it was like two or three a day that I would kill them. And uh, now I'm seeing like one every week. I killed three in one week, but that was three on the same day. Um, so yeah, they're not fun. They're they're very scary looking. And they like my area for some reason. I don't have water around, but they like my area. Um, Sonic. Yeah. There goes one of my brothers. <coughs> <coughs> okay, he quickly decided, but came back up, so he's fine. So, the other thing is that I'm going to be happy to move away from is also since we're on a pocket of water, supposedly, um, 
we have mosquitoes really, really badly. And my mom found this recipe on Facebook, so that way we can try it to get rid of the mosquitoes, because for some reason mosquitoes loves mom and me. <coughs> like, we go out to go check the mailbox, and we have like 10, maybe 15 bites. Um... I mean, that's probably over, that, that's probably too much, but it, around about 10 to 15 bites, we'll have like an entire, like one of our arms just covered in bites. So, I go outside um, quite often to just go outside and that implies I smoke, so I go out there to just chill out for a little bit. And one of my entire arms is totally 100% eaten up. And then, like, my feet get eaten. The other arm doesn't get touched. It's just one of my arms gets touched, and I don't know why. Um, so I get eaten a lot, and I am tired of being eaten. And even though we're like, brother, no. Sorry again. Just for a warning from now on, um, it is summertime here, so they're on summer vacation. Um, so I don't get the option of having quiet time unless I record at night and right now if since I'm sick right now I don't feel like recording at night um when I get better I'll probably record at night whenever they're asleep but at this moment since I am feeling kind of ill I am recording during the day and that's only because I feel ill um otherwise I will be recording at night so you guys don't have to listen to screamers while I'm record uh, while trying to watch my deal so just fair warning right now I will have a lot of background noise until I get over whatever I need to get over um, like I said this is just allergies so It'll run its course. Um, don't know when I'm going to get over it, to be completely honest. I just know right now it's running its course. So, you're going to hear a lot of background noise. You're going to hear me scream at my brother. Um, you're even going to hear me say, you know, get in here and let's sit down and have quiet time. Because uh, at that point, he is in trouble. He knows better not to scream, but he screams anyway. So he goes in timeout. Um, so just fair warning for right now until I feel better. I'm recording during the day uh, while I. Uh, get to feeling better, I guess. I don't know. Uh, though, some uh, two weeks in June and two weeks in July, uh, my brother will have ESY, which is just basically, um, since he has special needs, uh, it's just make sure that they don't fall behind. Um, so, Two, in, two weeks in June and two weeks in July, he'll have ESY. So, but that leaves um, two brothers instead of one. So, but that's all good for me. Um, I would rather them, I would rather have, you know, the two quiet ones. The two quiet ones, they all they do is desat, or the feeding pumps go off. That's it. They're not as loud as the five-year-old. 
So now, unless they start to cry, that that's a little bit different. So all right, I think I'm at my limit here for this because I really don't feel like doing very much more. Um, I am trying to do um, an hour on this video, but I think I'm at my limit. My limit is basically my body is telling me, okay, we need to go lay down. Or I'm about to fall asleep. So I think I'm going to stop here. That was, let's see, I'm going to be on this one, which is B. I'm going to find my next color first. No. 3320E. Yep. Okay. Found my next color, which is going to be this color. Uh, I don't know if that will help. Yeah, that just washes it out. It's like an orange color. But, anyway. Um, I'm going to stop it here. I've... So, I do apologize to everyone. Um, until I feel better, my videos will probably be a little bit shorter than usual. And so yeah, 36 minutes is 10:18. Right. I'll see you guys. I hope you all have a lovely day, and hopefully, um, you guys get out to do stuff, and you guys aren't getting as sick as I am. So, until then, my friends, see you later. Bye.